How to set up flat rate shipping on Etsy. Hi and welcome to Tech Tricks Tutorial. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to set up flat rate shipping on Etsy. This is a step-by-step -step beginner guide for everyone to follow easily. If you find this tutorial helpful, please don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button. Now let's get right into it. So the very first step that we need to do is to simply sign in to our Etsy shop dashboard. So here we are going to go to our settings in the left hand panel and the next thing that we're going to do is go to our shipping settings. Now here in our shipping settings, what we are going to do next is that we are going to simply create a new profile. So click on this button right here and after which we will basically be routed in this section. Now we need to input all the information that are necessary in this um, creating our shipping profile. So first is the country of origin, your postal code, and the processing time. Now for standard shipping, it means only shippers within the country. And then everywhere else, this is how much it would cost for all the places outside your country. Okay, you need to um, input your shipping service and its delivery time and what will you what will you charge for that? So whether it's a free shipping or a fixed rate. So there, you just need to input the rate if you want to have a fixed price on it. And then for the additional item, you can also add that one right there. Now for this uh, one, you can also add your options there and we're gonna choose fixed price simply follow the process okay now what we're going to do next is we are going to input our profile name right here if you want to give buyers the option to choose for a faster shipping you can actually have a shipping upgrade by clicking on add a shipping upgrade and then click on save profile afterwards once you create the listing um, on your shipping details you just need to choose this shipping that we have created so that's about it for today's video thank you so much for watching hope you find this tutorial helpful